Library on Saturday for a Catterday event, and, you know, she was a little bit like, little reading, you know, yeah, yeah, you know, she, she did a little napping in the library. Ah, oh, there um, you go. You know, she was like, oh, what, where, what, why am I here, why am I in a different cage, why are there, you know, small children everywhere, but, but then she was like, eh, it's fine, and then she just kind of laid down in her cage and, like, took a nap, like... So what's the deal with Emerald? What, uh, is she uh, ready to go? Like, does she have any special restrictions on her or anything? There are no restrictions on Emerald. Um, she is uh, a cat that came to us as a stray. She is a beautiful cat. She's a tortie. Yes. And she's very confident as she you know, makes herself right at home exploring everything in the studio. Just like, what can I get into? <laughs> um, yes. Make yourself at she home. She is quite a, a chatty cat. So if you're looking for a quiet cat, she might not be the, the one that's the best fit for you. Okay. She, she likes to talk. She likes to be like, hey, where's my breakfast? And hey, you're not paying attention to me. Like, So you know when she's around. So she's social. She's very social. Um, she doesn't seem to mind the other cats. You know, she was in, they were in separate cages, but they were close to each other at the library on, right. on a table and didn't seem to bother her. Um, I tried, I was doing a dog test with her the other day. Uh, it was hard because the cat across from her despises dogs. <laughs> um, had a very uh, strong reaction, but she yeah. was just like, oh, there's a dog over there. Aww. Okay. <laughs> okay, but that's gonna, good. It's not going to affect my day. Right. right. So she, she she'd be fine with, you know, anything. Okay. Um, she's, Fairly patient, fairly tolerant. Okay. Um, she can be held. She likes, you know, to play and get attention. What are um, you estimating her age to be? So we're saying between one and two. Um, so still fairly young. Yeah. Everybody was like, I want to get a kitten so that they can grow up with my family. Like, you know, yeah. Uh, kittens are only a year younger than a yes. one-year-old cat, so they're all still gonna Emerald to grow with your family. Right, right yeah. in there. And she's just, she's just, she's super soft, and mm -hmm. um, she just has a personality. Like she used to. You know, so pretty. In the shelter, the cats on the front side of the room are cats that have never had a cold before. It's just like we can get sure. colds they can. And then sure. if they get a cold, they move to the, the back side, okay. right? Um, so that we're not cross-contaminating. And right. she was used to being on the front. She was like, yeah, I get breakfast first. <laughs> and then she got moved to the back side. And now, like, all morning, like, she has a personality. She's like, like where's my breakfast? is late. I don't like this. Like, this. This new situation is not as good. This new house is not as good. <laughs> Breakfast is, you know, late, late. <laughs> on this end. <laughs> She's, like, complaining to management. Um, so she That's definitely funny. has, like, a personality. She's yes. really fun. Um, but with kittens coming, you know, the, the cats that are, you know, not old, just older, um, are, are kind of getting a little bit overlooked. So the good things about cats that are, you know, more in the adult stages of their lives is they're a little bit more calm. Mm. They're a little less needy, right? They're not going to be waking you up all the time because they were demanding of your attention. True, because it's like um, almost having a newborn. Yeah, like, they need I to feed and stuff. Yeah, and I and I like to. I, they're all toddlers, right? Sure. <laughs> but so like all cats are kind of like having toddlers in the house, but having kittens is like having like toddlers in the terrible twos, right? Because yes. they're into everything. They're, they don't know what they can and can't play with, sure. and everything's new, and they're exploring it and figuring it out. And you know, adult cats have maybe been in a home before. So they, they kind of know what things are. They're not into things. They have some boundaries. Even cats that come as strays have often, you know, been in a house before. So they know. They're domesticated. Yeah. <laughs> they know not to climb the curtain and stuff like that. And you know, know. you know, if they're going to be more calm or more, more relaxed or more patient. Whereas kittens, you don't really know. So there are a lot of benefits to getting an adult cat as opposed to a kitten. Great benefits for kittens, too. But, you know, um, kittens don't have trouble finding forever homes. Sure, um, sure. You know. So how, how can Emerald be part of our family forever? So if you want to visit with Emerald, you want to go to visit fcac.as.me to book an appointment. Um, we're still doing that. It's been working out really well. And, um, make sure everybody gets really good customer service that way. So you can do that to visit with her. Perfect. Um, you can fill out applications beforehand, or you can get one while you're visiting. And if you want to fill it out beforehand, you can get those on our website, which is... Um, frederickcountymd.gov um, nice. slash FCAC and then there's tabs on the left hand side hit the adopt tab and then it goes over the entire adoption process where you can get those downloadable um, applications where the cat dogs are going yeah. Oh, wonderful. Girl. So if you want to take Girl. Emerald home, that's the way to do it. If you want to see her, she happens to be on the Key 103 Radio <laughs> Facebook page Facebook Live. She has personality and then some. Emerald could be your furry friend with Key 103. That's a good girl. Oh, you're so